Have you ever wished you could see beyond what people show on the surface? Understanding what's behind someone's mask can be a powerful skill, whether in personal relationships, at work, or in everyday interactions. Today, I'll share with you 10 effective ways to read anyone, unveiling the secrets hidden behind their masks. By the end of this video, you'll be equipped with the tools to perceive what others might be trying to conceal. Let's unveil these insights. Number 10. Observe Body Language Cues Body language provides a wealth of information about a person's true feelings and intentions. When you're interacting with someone, notice how they position themselves. Are their arms crossed, suggesting a defensive or closed-off attitude? Or are they open and relaxed, indicating comfort and openness? Pay close attention to their facial expressions as well. A genuine smile, for instance, involves not just the mouth, but also the eyes. Observe their posture. Leaning in can show interest and engagement, while leaning back might indicate disinterest or a desire for space. These subtle cues can reveal a lot about someone's internal state beyond what they might verbally express. Number 9. Listen to the tone of voice The tone of voice can be a clear indicator of someone's emotional state and truthfulness. A voice that suddenly goes higher might suggest the person is lying or feeling nervous. On the other hand, a calm, steady voice often indicates confidence and honesty. Pay attention to the pace of their speech as well. Rapid speech can signify excitement or anxiety, while slow speech might suggest they're choosing their words carefully or trying to calm themselves. Also notice any changes in volume. A sudden increase can denote excitement or anger, whereas a decrease might imply secrecy or uncertainty. The tone of voice can provide significant insight into someone's emotions and thoughts, sometimes more accurately than their actual words. Number 8. Analyze Word Choice The specific words people use in conversation can offer important clues about their mindset and truthfulness. For instance, someone using vague language and non-committal phrases like maybe, sort of, I guess, could indicate uncertainty or an unwillingness to commit to a statement. Absolutes like always or never often point to exaggeration or a lack of nuance in their viewpoint. Additionally, pay attention to how they refer to themselves and others. Frequent use of I might suggest self-focus or accountability, depending on the context, while avoiding I could indicate a desire to deflect responsibility. Someone's word choice can reveal their attitudes, level of certainty, and even hidden intentions or feelings they aren't openly expressing. Number 7. Check for micro-expressions Micro-expressions are brief, involuntary facial expressions that reveal a person's true emotions, often contradicting what they say. These expressions can occur in as little as 1 25th of a second, making them challenging yet insightful to catch. For example, a quick furrowing of the brow might indicate confusion or disagreement, even if the person verbally agrees with you. A flash of a genuine smile, known as the Duchenne smile, can show real pleasure or approval, while a fake smile that doesn't reach the eyes might suggest insincerity. Learning to spot and interpret these microaggressions can give you a significant advantage in understanding true feelings and intentions beyond the masks people wear. Number 6. Consider the context The context in which interactions occur greatly influences how people present themselves. In professional settings, individuals might adopt a more formal or guarded demeanor, while in social settings they might display a more relaxed or open persona. Contextual cues also include the physical environment, the nature of the relationship, and the presence of others. For instance, a person might be more guarded in a public setting, but more open and genuine in a one-on-one -on -one situation. Understanding the context helps you interpret behavior and communicate more accurately as it provides insight into why people might be wearing a particular mask in that situation. Number 5. Detect Inconsistencies Inconsistencies between a person's words and actions are often telltale signs that they are not being completely truthful or authentic. For example, if someone expresses happiness but displays body language that suggests sadness, such as slumped shoulders or a lack of eye contact, it can indicate that they are masking their true feelings. Similarly, someone who frequently promises to take action but repeatedly fails to follow through might be offering assurances that they don't genuinely intend to keep. Noticing these inconsistencies requires careful observation and can provide valuable insights into a person's reliability, emotional state, and the congruence between their internal and external selves. Number 4. Pay attention to social media habits. 
Social media behavior can be a revealing indicator of someone's personality and how they want to be perceived. For instance, frequent updates or curated posts might imply a desire for validation or an attempt to project a certain image. The content they share and interact with can also provide clues as to their interests, values, and priorities. For example, someone who often posts about achievements might be achievement-oriented or seeking acknowledgement. Conversely, a sparse or highly private social media presence might suggest a person who values privacy or is less driven by external validation. Observing these habits helps you understand the persona they're projecting to the world and how it aligns with their real-life behavior. Number 3. Observe Reaction to Stress A person's response to stress or conflict can reveal their true character and coping mechanisms. Some might remain calm and analytical, indicating high emotional intelligence and resilience. Others might become agitated or defensive, suggesting difficulty handling pressure or propensity toward emotional reactions. Observing someone in these situations can give you insights into their temperament, problem-solving skills, and how they might handle future conflicts or challenges. This understanding is crucial in gauging how they might react in high-stress situations or when faced with adversity. Number 2. Evaluate Consistency Over Time Evaluating a person's consistency over time is about observing whether their actions, words, and attitudes remain steady across different situations and periods. Consistency is a key indicator of authenticity and reliability. When people wear a mask or present a false persona, maintaining this facade constantly over time can be challenging. Inconsistencies might surface, such as contradictions between what they say and do, or variations in their behavior depending on the situation or audience. For instance, a person might proclaim certain values or beliefs, but their actions in various contexts may contradict these stated principles. Someone who claims to be collaborative and team-oriented, but regularly takes credit for others' work or undermines colleagues in meetings exhibits inconsistency. Similarly, if someone's demeanor drastically changes, say from being warm and friendly in social settings to cold and dismissive in private, it could indicate that they are not showing their true self. Observing someone over an extended period of time allows you to see if they adapt their persona to suit different people or environments. It's important to note that everyone adapts to some extent. It's natural human behavior. However, significant and frequent shifts might suggest that the person is not being entirely genuine. Consistency also applies to emotional responses and decision-making patterns. People with a stable sense of self tend to have predictable and understandable reactions and make decisions that align with their known values and past behavior. In contrast, someone who often reacts unpredictably or makes decisions that seem out of character might be either going through personal changes or not revealing their true nature. Number 1. Trust your intuition Trusting your intuition when reading people involves tuning into your inner feelings and gut reactions when interacting with or observing someone. This intuitive sense is the culmination of your subconscious mind processing various cues and patterns in human behavior, which your conscious mind might overlook. It's like an internal alarm system, alerting you to discrepancies and congruencies between someone's outward behavior and their underlying intentions or emotions. Your intuition might manifest as a sudden hunch, a feeling of comfort or unease about someone without a clear, logical reason. It could be the sense that something is off about a person's sincerity, or conversely, a feeling of trust and authenticity emanating from them. These gut feelings are often based on subtle cues such as micro-expressions, tone of voice, word choice, and body language that might not consciously register. For example, you might meet someone who says all the right things, but you can't shake off a feeling of unease. This might be your intuition picking up on subtle inconsistencies in their behavior or micro-expressions that signal deceit. On the flip side, you might feel instantly at ease with someone indicating that their body language and tone are congruent with genuine friendliness and openness. As you can see, reading people is a skill that combines keen observation, empathy, and intuition. While it's essential to see through people's masks, remember to approach this skill with respect and understanding. Everyone has reasons for the masks they wear, and our goal should be to foster deeper connections and understanding, not invade personal boundaries. What's one sign you've noticed that helped you read someone accurately? Share your experiences in the comments below. If you've made it this far, type 100% in the comments to confirm that you've gained valuable insights from this video. For more enlightening topics, don't forget to check out the recommended video on your screen. 
Thanks for watching.